In our second microgreens experiment, we will be growing beetroot microgreens in the IKEA Vaxa with rock wool as a growing medium. I've also planted some non microgreen beetroot seeds, and these have also come out the same, and I'm not sure if I actually taste the difference. When you're ready to harvest, simply grab a small bunch, cut very near the stem with a pair of scissors and indulge. In our second microgreens experiment we should be growing some organic beetroot all the way from Holland and some normal beetroot seed to see if we can spot the difference. Once again we've cut down a grow down, cut it in half and measured it against the grow tray and it will go in the IKEA Vaxa. If you do buy a grow down I recommend getting it from your local hydroponic shop as they're about four to five pounds as opposed to £11 plus postage from Amazon. So we add the floats, add the rock wool, and give it a good old soak. This is not as absorbent as the IKEA rock wool cubes, so it probably need an extra half an hour to soak all the water in. Then we'll just gently sprinkle the seeds, I'll just do a few for the camera, but you get the gist. And I'll spread them all over and give them a, a spray in. So that's them all sprayed in. So we've got 100 over here, the normal beetroot, and then the 10 grams, which I imagine is about four to 500. So all we're gonna do is put on the propagator lid now, and we'll come back over the next few days. I do hope we can inspire you to get started growing microgreens with results in just 10 days. It's as easy as growing cress at school and will be one of the trends of 2019. After gardening will save the world, won the silver medal at the show gardens category at the world famous Chelsea Garden Show 2019. Don't expect to be on the show next year but do get started growing microgreens as the health benefits are also an added incentive. 